Hi book nerds, my name is Simon Mayo, I'm speaking to you from London and I'm here to tell you about this which is my novel called Itch, The Explosive Adventures of an Element Hunter. And you might think, stop there, who's Itch and what's element hunting? So in order, Itch is short for Itchingham Loft, he is 14 years old, he goes to school in Cornwall in the southwest of England. He lives with his mum and dad, his sister Chloe who's 11 years old and get this, they get on quite well. And his best friend at school is his cousin Jacqueline who's also 14 and Itch, Jack and Chloe are at the heart of this story. Itch's passion is science and the thing he likes the most is element hunting. He used to collect Pokemon cards and stamps and all that kind of stuff. He decided that was boring and now he's an element hunter. You may well remember uh, a chart on the wall in science, it might be there still, and it had the periodic table on it. Hydrogen, helium, lithium, beryllium, boron, loads of stuff you've never heard of, some stuff you had, like gold and tin and copper and hydrogen and oxygen and that kind of stuff. An element hunter is someone who wants to collect all 118 as far as is legal and as far as is healthy. And this is what Itch does. He spends the whole book adding to his collection. Unfortunately, this brings him into contact with some very strange and some very dangerous rocks. These rocks are behaving in a way that no rocks have ever behaved before. They are fiercely radioactive. They are unbelievably dangerous. But they're very, very valuable. Lots of people would like to get them. Scientists would like them. The police would like them. Uh, criminals and terrorists would like them. And it makes Itch, Jack and Chloe the most hunted children in the world. Itch has to decide what to do with the rocks and whether he makes the right decision or not, you'll have to read in the novel. I hope you enjoy it. I kind of enjoyed writing it. Let me know what you think.